Assalamualaikum and hi everyone My name is Ahmad Faizrul and you guys can call me Faiz Today in this short video I will show you guys about type of quadrant brain model So before that I will show you guys what is quadrant So quadrant is a brain quadrant It is a term used to describe learning styles that divides the brain into four quadrants Each is each representing a different way of thinking and processing information in this short video, I will tell you guys about, about type of quadrant brain model. So before that, I will tell you guys about what is quadrant. So we have four quadrant. Quadrant A, quadrant B, quadrant C and quadrant D. So for the quadrant A is analytical thinking. So for the quadrant A is more like analytical thinking. And for the quadrant B, and for the quadrant B is a more interpersonal communication. Empathy and emotional intelligence. For the quadrant C, is more planning, organizing, and attention to detail. So for the quadrant D, is a creativity, innovation, and holistic thinking. So this is a website that called VARK Test, which is to help you to recognize your brain quadrant, which is your have to answer question in the website. As soon as I answered the VARK test, I have known my strongest quadrant. So this is my result. So my result strongest quadrant is kinesthetic and aural. This is my quadrant. My quadrant is C. I like to cook by myself because it easy to me to memorize all the recipe that I cook. Because in the kinesthetic, it's like to learn in practical way. The second activity that I very love and enjoy is hiking. Because I can enjoy the view and the nature that it presents to us and the nature gives me happiness and help me reduce stress in life. Hiking also teach me the importance of take care of your life because when you go to hiking, it challenges your body to move forward in the condition you face. Likely, many benefit from hiking such as in case study of science, find out that hiking help your mental health in positive effect such as reduce anxiety and stress. Oh, this is my trip hiking was in Smechili. I really enjoy see the river along the hiking and and the air is fresh that make me want to stay there Sungai Chiling also have waterfall and you can swim there also but you can't bring outside food here so you can't eat food here more likely I like to spend my time in, in jogging in the park I experienced jogging in the Putrajaya so there is so many people there jogging in there too so this I just want to share my view trip to Genting Highland with my friends so for the next activity I like to listen to music Listening to music helped me memorize vocabulary words or practice work. in foreign language like Korean, Indian, and many else. So I like to activity like learning together. To me, learning together is a process that to easy memorize the thing that we study in. In top of that, it's helped me to be creative person such as brainstorming to make a new idea not only that i think that work together make the work more competent than individual that's all for my short video i hope you enjoy thank you